In this tutorial, I'm going to give you just a very brief overview of how to use templates in iMovie. Uh, the templates in iMovie could be used to create a quick book trailer or to sort of summarize something that's going on in your class. So once you open iMovie, um, you'll make sure that you're on projects. And then you're going to tap the plus, time, plus sign up here in the corner to start a new project. And we're going to take a look at trailers. So on the um, iPad app, they have a number of different trailers available. Um, you can just use your finger to scroll through down at the bottom. And um, you can preview that by pressing the play. And it will give you just kind of a quick view of what that is like. I'm going to stop that. And the other thing you want to look for is um, down at the bottom, it will have two to six cast members. That means there would be two to six people featured in the trailer. So if I was going to just show you how to do this real quick, um, if I click on this one, it has two cast members. I'm going to choose create to make this trailer. And it's going to pop up with an outline view. And on the outline view, you just change all of the information to your own information or to the book information. Okay, and then you um, change your cast members to who you have for your different cast, um, add, directed by, edited by, things like that. And then once you have all of this information filled in, and a lot of times you just fill in the same information all the way down, you click on storyboard. And then this is where you see the kinds of pictures or the little video clips that you're going to add in. And um, it gives you an idea of like you should have a close up here, you should have two in the shot, you should have an action shot. And then you just add things into your video. You can add it from the camera or you can add it from um, video down at the bottom. This is a little out of the range here, but down at the bottom you can um, Add, or you can press camera or photos. So if you have photos, then you can just add in your photos by pressing on them and it's going to drop it right in and go to the next one. And I'm kind of adding some random things to give you an idea. And then what would happen is once you have all of those things filled in, you can kind of play it. And you'll see what that looks like as a whole. And all you have to do with this is um, simply drag and drop things in um, and you'll get a professional looking video.